rare bipartisan agreement on Capitol Hill over a $1 trillion spending bill that includes billions in new defense spending and $1.5 billion for border security, but not a single dollar for President Trump's border wall, despite the president's insistence that a wall is necessary at Saturday's campaign rally. We'll build the wall, folks. Don't even worry about it. Go to sleep. Go home, go to sleep, rest assured. That's the final thing we needed. Also left out of the bill, federal cuts to sanctuary cities and money for a deportation force, two of the president's other campaign promises. At the heart of my administration's efforts to restore the rule of law has been a nationwide crackdown on criminal gangs, and that means taking the fight to the sanctuary cities that shield these dangerous criminals from removal. The spending bill includes some victories for Democrats, including no cuts to Planned Parenthood funding, a nominal cut to the EPA's budget, a $2 billion increase for the National Institutes of Health, which the president targeted for budget cuts, and $295 million to help Puerto Rico continue making payments to Medicaid, a Democratic demand the president has spoken out against multiple times. The bill also includes millions to reimburse local law enforcement for extra security for the president and first family when they travel to Florida and New York. Other bipartisan victories include $407 million in wildfire relief for western states and a permanent extension to a program that provides health insurance for coal miners, a key constituency for President Trump. Who are the miners here? The miners, finally, we're taking care of our miners. We love our miners.